Hi, welcome to Seoul, Korea. There are lots of exciting things in Seoul, and many people say that they're very impressed by convenient public transportation, especially subway. You know, Korea has a population of more than 50 million, and people who live in Seoul and its suburb area are about 20 million. It means Seoul is a very packed and crowded city and it results in traffic jam, especially in rush hour. Taking taxi or bus sometimes cannot guarantee your arriving at your destination on time, but subway does. Let me explain why you should take the subway, how to see the subway map, how to get a ticket, and finally, how to take it. Let's see why we should take subway in Seoul, Korea. First of all, there are more than 500 subway stations around Seoul and its suburb area. You can go almost anywhere you want by just using subway. Secondly, the fare is really cheap. You can go almost anywhere with one or two dollars. Furthermore, all the subway lines are integrated, and this means that you just buy one ticket from your departure and you can go anywhere without having to buy additional tickets no matter how many transits you make. More surprisingly, the system is also integrated with public bus system, so you can transit from subway to bus, or vice versa, seamlessly, without purchasing additional tickets. Third thing is that, as I mentioned earlier, there is no word like traffic jam in the underworld. Subway is very punctual, and you can rely on it most of the time. Last thing is that it is clean and nice. Air conditioning makes you refreshed even in the hot and humid summer weather. Well, taking subway has many advantages over other transportation, but keep in mind that there sometimes can be some inconveniences. First, huge number of commuters use subway when they go to work or back home. So it's very crowded from 8 to 9 a.m. and 6 to 7 p.m. At some most crowded subway stations, you can even see the pushman who push people into the subway. Oh my god! Second, most stations have escalators, but a few of them, especially old ones, they just have steps instead of escalator. You have to walk up and down hundreds of steps. Let's just think that walking is good for our health. Let's learn how to see the subway map. First of all, let's go to www.soulmetro.co.kr and you can see the subway map there. First of all, let's click Go button to go to English mode. There is a subway guide Click it, and you can see the cyber station. Let's click it. The blue line from west to east is Han River. Northern part is called Gangbuk, and southern part is called Gangnam, as we recognize in size Gangnam style. Central Park is Seoul, and Border Park is Suburb Area. Central lines are made up of line 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. Please notice that line 2 is a circulating line. Other lines are built for suburb areas, but they are also integrated with central lines. You can search your station name by clicking here. It is aligned by alphabetical order. You can check out the route from this map. Let's say that your hotel is located around Samsung Station, 
and you're going to Myeongdong for shopping. Click Samsung as your departure. And click Myeongdong as your arrival. Yes, you can see how to get there. You can go there by transferring once at Dongdaemun History Culture Park. You can download or print map by clicking these buttons here, and you can get station map from any subway station's information desk. Now it's time for us to give it a try. This is Apujang Rodeo Station. Let me show you how to buy a ticket to get to Nemlong Station. Step 1. Choose your language and click it. Step 2. Click Destination Selection. Step 3. Choose your destination by browsing. Step 4. Put the number of tickets you wish. Step 5. Insert the amount of money. Step 6. Get your ticket. Step 7. Keep the change. Step 8. Take the receipt if you want. Now that you take a ticket, you can go to take a subway passing by entrance with your ticket tap on the detector. Your one-time ticket price includes deposit, which is 500 won. You can refund it right after passing by exit at your destination. You can get a ticket using vending machine every time you take the way. But there is a more convenient way. It's called tea money. You can take tea money with you, and you don't have to get a one-time ticket every time you take the way. It's so cool! You can buy tea money from any convenience store or vending machine located at any survey station and booth store besides bus station. You can use it as long as there are balance remained. Usually, you can take subway 5 to 9 times with 10,000 won, depending on your travel length. Where to charge it? You can charge it from any convenience store vending machine from any subway stations, and you can also do it at a boot store beside bus station. If you're traveling using both subway and bus, tea money is a must-have. There's no extra charge for transiting from bus and subway, and vice versa, but you cannot have the benefit if you're taking one-time ticket because it doesn't have the capability. The most important and used amenity will be restrooms. As far as I know, all the stations have free-to-use restrooms. It's not only free, but also clean. I don't think the bathroom was that clean 10 years ago, but it's been improved a lot, and I think it's the one of the cleanest restrooms around the world. Most stations have convenience store and at least vending machines, and some of them even have mini-libraries where you can take a rest while seated. Among more than 500 subway stations, there are about 50 transit stations. Sindor Rim Station is famous, or notorious, for a huge number of people who transit. About 350k people are transiting there. By the way, do you know which station has the biggest number of people boarding or getting off? It's Gangnam Station. The number is more than 120k. 
You can experience the thrill of claustrophobia there, especially on special days such as Christmas Eve or Saint Valentine's Day. All the areas are literally packed with, fully with people. It's unbelievable. Are you ready for trying Subway in Seoul? I hope this video helps you. Thank you for listening. Let me show you how to how to buy a ticket to get to Myeongdong Station. <laughs> 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 <laughs>